Well, here in Ukraine, still many people criticize, uh, namely Germany and France. Does that mean that there are still a lot of contradictions going on in, in, inside the EU? I, you know, I think they've been exaggerated. I mean, even though the Germans can't, aren't, aren't doing some things, such as providing the heavy weapons that maybe the, the it, it's, not, it, that it's a contested topic in, in, in the coalition, they're still not interfering with other countries doing so. I mean, what we feared was there would be disputes within the allies that would render NATO inoperable. And so the U.S. as, a, as an effective means of countering the invasion. So the U.S. would have to work with Britain and others and cobble together a sort of a coalition of the willing uh, to, to, to do this. But so, so far, we even some, some countries have, have been, if they're holding back, they're not holding back others. They're just staying back themselves. Um, and I, I give the credit, some credit for the Germans in terms of reversing a lot of their historical reluctance to confront Russia um, in general. And, you know, it's not as much as we would have liked, but I think it's more than we thought we'd get.